on button. Set, I mean, it's set to check continuity. So if it's a connector, there are any short circuit. And it's, uh, I want to check if the fuse is uh, wrong. So therefore, it's not working. Check if the fuse is working. Yep, it works. So the fuse is working. It fits on one side. One goes wrong. Then probably maybe there's a short circuit. Yes. No, we check. There's three pin. One here. Another one in the middle. You can. I hope you can see it. And the last one at the side. Okay. We need the one at the side. Normally it's the earth. See if it's in the short circuit. All right. The earth is working. Then probably the new the maybe check with the live okay live wire it's working in the middle is live neutral no neutral no neutral no neutral going to here so meaning the neutral from here to here is not working I use an adapter because last time I got it from OC I got an adapter oh look at here it's broken. Probably my my plug is working. It's not meant for Malaysia. I think that's why I need to get a, a travel adapter. Let me open up this. Have a look. The neutral seems are not working. What do I see. Oh, it seems like it's blown. It's burned. Okay, it's burned. The fingers have some burn mark here. Wow, okay. So this is 40. Let's change it. So I'm going to change this plug to cut it. Ta da! 3 pin plug. So in the market, there are two types of uh, 3 pin plug available in the market. Okay. So how do you differentiate it from the same company? One is heavier than another. If you want to use it for heating element, kettle for example, or um, ironing, ironing machine for example, okay, I would recommend a more heavy duty one, or maybe this one is considered the water heater switch, are meant for heating element. You can feel it, it's solid compared to this one. They both have a serum code, but they have different serum code from Malaysia. So this one is the cheaper one, it cost me about four ringgit versus nine ringgit. So I'm going to use this one, the 9 ring one. Okay, place this aside. So this is a wiring diagram. The brown represents the live. The blue represents the neutral. E represents the earth. But the earth wire has to be longer. So I need to cut a longer wire for earth. And then you need to trim short live and neutral. It's color coded. The blue color neutral, the brown one live go through a fuse, and this is for new uh, earth. Oh, the length probably I'll go this way. Okay, maybe I'll trim. This is the length. I need to trim. Okay, all right. Just need to remove the sleeve. Then score a line, not too deep. Just enough to remove. The insulator, and then this is the earth wire. The green yellow is for I meant for the earth. Okay, allow this length. Once when it's a level, the end level with this length should be roughly around the correct length. Score line, push it, and then there you go. This is meant to go into here goes around then I'll do the same this is live wire make sure this this tip is aligned with this length that's the correct length of copper you need okay so this one here align with this length it for earth, loosen the screw for earth, go 
Hold that. Tighten it. Not too tight until it breaks the copper. So what we're going to do is uh, remove this fuse. So that you will see it properly. Right. So I remove the fuse, then you can actually see it now. Fuse. I then just need to slot it into here. Push in with one finger and then use a screwdriver to tighten the screw for live. Right hand side is for live. Then remember to install the fuse. I remove the fuse for illustration purpose. Not too tight until it breaks the copper. This is a fuse. Place it back. When the heat or the current that passed through here exceeded 13 amp, the fuse wire would break. Therefore, you cut off the circuit. So this, this one is color code. Right? You check if you have a good contact. Yep. Okay. You do not want to tighten it too tight until it breaks the copper. Push it in between. All right. All right. So the blue one's on the left, the brown one on the right, the up one here it are meant for neutral. Okay. Then close it back. It should work now. Remember, you want to choose a more expensive version if it were meant for cattle. Or else, this thing would happen. Then we we'll use a travel adapter. Alright, so I've replaced the plug to the new one compared to the old one. Okay. They are two different shapes. Okay. So, plug it in. And then switch on the plug. There we go. It's working. Boiling now. Time after the video, can you subscribe to my channel? Press the bell button two times so that you get notified my new video and a picture comes up. With that, see you next time. Bye!